Uh, so that's what she. So that's it. That's all she went through, losing her losing her husband. Look, I know, I know about losing someone you really care about. Cause trust me, man, I've been through that before. But we're good now, cause. Um, I'm friends with the King of Fear. I asked him if he could revive that person, but, uh, yeah. The, um, yeah. But for her, for her, she's got nothing on me, man. Nothing. I'll tell you. Um, for one, I lost my mother when she, she died when she gave birth to me, so I never got the chance to see what she looked like. My father had to raise me. After a while, my father went insane. Over lost for went insane and got thrown, got put into an asylum. And also, I lost a person I cared about. My father died on the attack on Skyfall. I was abducted and tortured by the Makudas. Reduced to from a war, from a proud war, from a proud prince, to a punch, to a personal punching bag. Because let me tell you something, that Detrix was was it? He sounds just like chaos. Because chaos doesn't give a shit about his own people, and it makes me sick. Because the fact there was this, because he blow he whenever he fights. And there's crowds of people, of his own people around him. He doesn't care about them. No, he just cares about himself. He's arrogant and selfish, and I hate him. Oh, and also the fact I got this freaking scar on my eye and lost a camp and lost an arm. And also the fact I. But, I mean, he blows up his own people all the time. Whenever he blows up a planet, he doesn't care about them. He just blows it up, and even if they are on that planet, he just blows it up. With, of course, the Liberator, the most powerful gun in the universe. Yeah, I know of it. But, uh, as, for, as for her, as for that girl, what's name? Keep slipping. Yeah, I could really care less about her. She's stupid. She neat and acting like a child. If she goes white crying to chaos, he's not going really. He's not going to do anything about it. He's just he's he's manipulative basically, and she is basically falling right. Right into his hands, basically. Blindly following him, blindly kiss, blindly kissing him, and praising him like he's the mo like he's the greatest thing ever. Because let me tell you something, he's not. He's a freaking monster. He's a he's a sadistic asshole, and I hate him. And the fact. That, uh, that he, he, I mean, not to mention the fact he rapes women, and I'm still pissed off with him with for raping sword axe. <sighs> Poor girl, she had to go through that crap again. Not just that, but he took on the form of Shadow Core. And us, yeah. But as for you, I'm glad you agree with me. I'm very glad you agree with me. We have... Because we both could care less about her. And stuff. You sound like a pretty cool guy. Maybe we could get together and hang out sometime. I can introduce you to the, to the king. The king of fear. Trust me, he's a nice guy when you get to know him. And, uh, of course, his sister, she's, she's, she's very, she's very sweet and kind, and, uh, I, I love her as, 
Because I'm basically like a brother figure to her. Stuff. But anyways, yeah. I'm very glad you you agree with me, man. The, you add, you're smart. You have good... You have a good sense of, of intelligence. So, yeah. Make a number response video when you're ready. I'll be rating.